Um, Ray Singer uh, could doing well. I don't have Chris Bubik up here. If you're a Royals fan, um, he came in with Brady on the short year. He did okay. Um, so did Brady. Um, but Brady's actually been consistent enough to where I keep him in my starting lineup. Uh, Chris uh, is having some trouble, so I kicked him back down to lower levels just to get better. But anyway, I want to get started here. We're gonna play the uh, the cheating Houston Astros. Uh, hopefully, we'll win them this game here. So. Um, it's been a while, like I said, since I've played. I've been playing a lot of War Zone, so hopefully I can slide in right where I left off. Brady Singer, a right-hander from Florida, gets the ball as the starter here. What's your take on him, Dan? Hey, you can tell by this strikeout-to-walk ratio, 2-1, to one, that this guy is more a pitch-to-contact guy than a strikeout-walk for a ball. Some pitchers fall into the trap of giving in on three and two because they don't want to walk the guy. But with the base open, it's not the end of the world if you do. You still need to make a quality pitch. There's a swing and a missile sent out to center field. Center fielder looking up, and this one is gone. A home run. Well, he won his last start, but he didn't give up any long balls. He's already given up two here, so he's got his work cut out for him if he's going to get the W in this one. He's going to have to start keeping the ball in the yard for starters. So here's Yuli Gurriel, skied into the straightaway right. And Dozier will put it away for out number three. Rough start. One out, nobody on. Swung on and there belted to the left by Perez. This one's deep. Adios, pelota. Still too early. I'm swinging too early. So a solo shot down the line in left, number 148 for his career. But they're going to need a few more here as they're still well behind. Yeah, they dug themselves quite a hole, Alabama. but they say the first thing you need to do when that happens is to stop. Oh. This one is smashed down the right field line. That's going to stay fair, and it's going to be back-to-back -back home runs. All right. I can do this. This is good. Got a long way to go. Swung on and hit deep to left center. This one has a chance. But that'll stay in the park as it's off the wall. Digging hard. He's headed for third. And he's in there at third with a one-out triple. So just like that, he's at third here with one away as we show you the league leaders in three base hits. And as you see, he's right up there among league leaders in that department. Ball. Another one sent foul. Now a ball hit in the air to straightaway left. This is carrying well out of here. A solo shot here to left. Eighth home run on the season for him. But that'll do little more than make a dent in this big deficit. Right hander are up to throw. Two balls and a strike to count. Hitters count now. Here's the two and one. Ball, that's low. If I'm in the box right now, I'm coming unglued. He is going to throw something over the heart of the plate. Now this one is blasted to left field, and there's no doubt about it. Back-to-back -back jacks. Well, a solo only shot eight more home runs to left. go. Career homer number 149, as it's now down to an eight-run ball game. Oh, I got I got my number one fan here. Say hi. <laughs> what are you playing? He's playing Fortnite. Boom. Thirteen to six. Good the final score in this ball game. Houston jumped out to an early lead in the first and yeah, never looked back. Way too many home runs gave up. Struggling again on that one. Both show, both show. Nope. There's that. Nope. Appreciate you uh, watching the game and listening to TJ talk about his Fortnite those last couple innings. So we'll talk to you later. And uh, we'll probably stream uh, whatever TJ is picking tomorrow. So this is, uh, this is Nate signing.